everyone, it's your District 2 Commissioner, Commissioner Richardson, and I am here on a very emotional day where we were able to close out one of our really, really important programs out of the cabinet, out of our community cabinet. So with that, I want to hand the mic over to our Veterans Affairs cabinet seat, Dan Heydrich, for all of the incredible work that he's been doing to share a little bit about what the Veterans Pod Project really was and what it did entail. We tried to get a place for veterans to go together. Once they're incarcerated and they, they witness that they're a veteran, they're actually put into the system in the vet pod. Well, gray walls and beds don't really suit well, so Ross Deck and I got together. We looked at all the pods around the United States. By the grace of God and Command Sergeant Major Owens and a few other helpful folks, it happened. Now we have a veterans pod, we can get to them, we can get their benefits described to them, we can meet with their attorneys, we can hopefully get them into Cobb County Accountability and Treatment Court. It, it's, it's all a function of serving veterans who served us a long time. And that's, today the unveiling was one of the most emotional art renderings I've seen in a long time. It, it's just, it's great to have the support as, a, as one of the commissioners veteran cabinet members. Um, we're now initiating what's called Connecting Cobb Veterans. So we're gonna push this out even further. But I thank you for all of you. We have some 70 some odd thousand veterans in Cobb County. There are more agencies. We just developed another one thanks to Cobb Commissioner's understanding. It's called Connecting Cobb Veterans. Our job is to make sure you get the services you fought so hard for. This mural is not just a pretty picture, it is an experience to get lost in. I made it for you guys to be able to have a, you know, a realization or being confronted, kind of like a friend request from your higher self or whomever it is that you believe in. Wherever you look at this painting, it's meant to be multi-dimensional. Everybody should be able to take something from it, whatever it is that you know pertains and speaks to you. We truly appreciate your work, appreciate everyone that worked with you. Um, Sheriff's Office certainly it was their willingness to take on this piece. Um, the coordination with the accountability courts as well, making sure that we can connect resources. Um, and we knew that we wanted to cap it off with a mural, to an art piece that represented everything and, and really just that, that doorway to, to the future. And so, um, having having a local artist who was looking for a place to paint a mural um, passionate about veterans who is a veteran who is a veteran <laughs> and when she reached out to our office Giovanni she it, it was she was looking for a place to paint we were looking for a painter and found each other connected her with Dan so that we could close this project out and today was just Amazing. beautiful it was beautiful so, thank you Giovanni thank you Sheriff Owens Thank you everyone in staff, thank you to our court, thank you fans. And you know what it really represents is they fought for us and now we have a chance to show that we can fight for them.